The question I have is, I know at the very least, being a member of IC, Jet does get in a few games with Bootless, so he's not a stranger to, to how Rosalina works. I am wondering, you know, what Freckles knows about Mega Man, because this is a matchup where you do kind of have to experience it. Like, you can't you can't just watch a bunch of notes on it and do super well. You just have to know what it feels like to be hit in the face with lemons constantly. I it's, guess it's, this like, is, it's like you know, but do you, like, yeah, know? Yeah. know. Yeah, yeah there, there's the feeling now and the thinking now. It's like everything looks nice on paper, but then when you put it out on the field, it's a whole new ball game. I do like the- Oh, Freckles is just stalling out really nicely, actually, with that up B, just very, staying up on those platforms. Very clever to just use the last bit of time that those platforms were out. And there he is, he gets the Luma back. I actually did not mention that we were out here uh, in the staple of this tournament. <laughs> you know, if I, w if I still competed, it would be unfortunate, because I actually bounced Bantown and City, like, every time. <laughs> Uh, RPS, hope you guys aren't catching on to this. Um, they, they understand. They, they took it out of my uh, my pay. I now have, like, you know, I don't have oh, a that, that anymore. Oh, that explains why you don't have the burger anymore. <laughs> Got it. They, they took your burger in the middle of your frames of eating it. Before. Absolutely. Uh, you know, those frames Ooh. are not really safe. Nice juggle. Yeah, Jet almost getting the connection on the... I've seen him actually He almost got the together. perfect, like, uh, frame just to hit that just uppercut, right? Yeah, yeah, this, the sweet spot. I've actually seen him do it. It's, uh, it's rather terrifying. It's a, it's, a, it's a work of art when he actually hits it. <laughs> wow, did, did that gear just disappear at the frame that he was about to grab it? Oh, Forder actually beating out that neutral B. And good spacing, Jet being aware that Lumo is going to lash out with a hitbox, just walked away diagonally and they can punish it. Okay, yeah. All right, brilliant, brilliant. Okay, he's going to have to find a way to disengage. You don't want to get hit by one of those. Then actually getting pretty close to the point where Rosalina can be killed with Mega Man up throw. Yep. Up, up smash up does smash the same is trick. Just gonna do the same yeah. formula of KOing anybody if you're at that position. Jet hanging on to that gear, doing pretty well. Yeah, the Metal Blade, not as powerful on Smash as it is in Mega Man 2, but still pretty good. I mean, does it have enough energy to keep using it multiple times? Yes, it does. <laughs> pretty busted. It's just as efficient as it was in 2. Oh, oh! Look at the lasting hitbox on that one. Yeah, I actually really like that as a setup. It catches, you know, three out of the four the, options. The, the most sour of sour spots. Oh, wow, just waking up into that rapid jab. That was a nasty little thing. Yeah. I, I like I like Freckles' ledge play, actually. I haven't seen this sort of thing out of uh, NorCal Roses. He hasn't really had the time to set it up, either. Because he, it's been Jet's game the whole match. So yeah. Far. Ooh, nice space. Trying to just get some jab pressure, Jet knowing how to disengage that platform where the gaps are. Got to use that to your advantage right now. In the time that they're currently out, they won't Has be there the double for too jump, long. And he's good. Very clean recovery. Jet's been doing this for the longest time. He knows his math is of getting back around. I like that uh, Freckles had a dash in front of Luma because they kept getting pelted by all those metal blades. He losing all the health already. Luma's already bleeding. Oh, Luma's dead after yep, that. Just, Luma's just in air. Oh boy, that could have been bad news. Okay, he's got to be using that a lot more. It's it's scary to do though because uh, that frees him up for uh, Jet to jump up and back air. Yeah, quite a few frames. <gasps> Whoa, that was the bravest holding of the shield. <laughs> what? Wait, what? I was he in leaf shield? I don't think he was in leaf shield. He was in leaf shield, but that doesn't like make you not able to live. Like I'm I'm actually not sure what Did happened. Did he use his jump? I think he used his jump. It seemed like it was just a simple execution error, but Jet doesn't seem too phased by it. I mean, he doesn't look too affected at all. He's still got that same pose he's got all the time. I gotta say, I give major props to the ones who can play Mega Man at this level. Because I tried doing it one night, but not. <laughs> Never again. I'll, doesn't I'll get the Trump. Oh, I'll stick man. To Mega Man 11 for this. He's actually using the crash bombs just to, as a means to like kind of like harass him more. And crash bombs are, are kind of like calling an assist in like three seconds, right? Oh! Wow! That was the one that killed. That was you the don't, one. You cannot, you cannot be jumping in those. Like that but was... That situation, it was already bad even leaving the ground. I mean, it was, it was bad, but with how fast he suddenly rose, it looked to me like he jumped. So like that when you're in the tornado, no no vertical movement at all. Like that will don't kill ever you. do that. Like, <laughs> you're going into orbit. Every, everybody dies to that once, and then uh, and then you remember. Like and then from then on, whenever you're in a tornado, you start freaking out. Remember, don't jump, don't jump, don't jump. But you know you gotta hit it by it once. Sounds like that. You just wish you had like a momentum canceling move. <clears throat> you know. Does we hit trainer have one of those? Is that yeah. what you're saying? Yeah. What, what you got? 
uh, deep breathing. Deep breathing, oh. That cancels all momentum. Ooh, okay, okay. Yeah. Just like, just like much was, I think Rosalina has that in her down beam. I'm not quite sure because I never really played her all too much. I don't all think I, all I know is that she does a little bit of momentum canceling. I don't think it's, I don't think it's big enough. It's uh, not large enough to stop that whirlwind yeah. from killing him. And we're taking it over to battlefield for game two. Jet, uh, currently on edge, but this is not really affecting him all too much because he actually likes playing on the edge. Here. Hmm. Ooh. Catching just the bottom of that nair with the up air. You gotta watch your toes. Watch that dress. Oh, nice. Okay. We get, we're playing. We're playing spacey right now. I like it. I like the fox trotting, trying to catch jets landing on one of those platforms. I think, he's starting, out, a, I think he's starting to get a feel of the area. I would like how far he can actually just start abusing it. Oh, he's right. holding on to the. Yep, there it is. Builds up a little bit of space and manages to sneak back on stage. He's gotta just create space waiting for Luma to come back. Oh, is he gonna make it to the stage? Alright. I get really scared whenever I see somebody recover. Dude, from that I get angle. anxiety anytime somebody's down there. <laughs> Uh, it's just that left side of battlefield, man. Yeah, like, any, even if you're Lucario with one of the best recoveries at a high percentage, like, <laughs> I still get scared because you might overshoot that way too far. Or you might just bonk your head on it. That's the worst part. <coughs> Did it go? Anyways. Ooh, that, that little tomahawk there didn't it face the right direction. Of course. Nothing you could do there. He didn't want to get caught in that situation. Getting sandwiched between these two is no bueno. Oh, wow. Freckles, I think, was uh, down smashing the moment he got grabbed. So Luma still got the down smash input and just hit Jet away immediately. Excellent play here. Ooh. <laughs> just denying him of the projectiles. I feel like he should be doing that a lot more when he's off stage. What, what more can he do with then focus on getting back? Using the leaf shield, trying to cover the options of the freckles. Gets right past it. Not today. Oh, nice shield grab. Now it's freckles under the pressure here. Oh, never mind. Switched right away. These guys are just kind of trading back and forth, but they're they're having a hard time really leveraging their advantage states into actual stocks on each other this game. Right now it's just racking it up so it's a lot more easier when that moment does happen. Uh, yeah, it's just going to be like trying to kill just out of straight neutral instead. Have you ever seen Luma uh, with the return Luma? Have you ever seen that kill? Uh, yeah, of course. It's terrifying and you feel stupid. but like, I feel like a complete moron when I actually die to that. I mean, like, it's happened to me, like, at least twice in my career of playing this game. The, the sickest thing is when they're returning Luma, then combos into something Gross is doing. That was gross. Did you see that? Yeah, that Nair. Yeah, that was super gross. That happened, like, uh, the ooh, the dash attack! That was a lunar landing. Was that, that was a lunar landing? That was actually disgusting, because Luma was doing a hitbox at the same time that Rosa was doing a dash grab. So that actually covered every option. That was sick. Yeah. <laughs> that was only like only the one with the sharp eyes can actually really catch that. I caught that at the like the latest moment. The moment you said that I was like, oh that's what happened. Mm. Yeah, it's 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 a bread and butter for like more advanced Rosas and it is uh part of the reason why she's a top tier is just she just has the, those abilities to ability lock to, down every option the opponent has. To deny the grab game almost. Just because of, you got an you got an out. <laughs> I mean that being said, I mean Jack got his Trump back air as well. Yeah. Took that stock. He's getting a little bit beat up this stock. But Ooh. uh Don't let don't get too much punishment now, Luma. And you're gonna take a seat for now. Oh, just two hits of back air, fast fall into a grab, and he's trying to take uh, it again. Nice, okay. I really like that, because this time he was ready for just Freckles to see his way past that, and he just, I'm going to punish your air dodge right out of this tornado instead. That's the, that's the one where you just have to be really cautious. Like, you're you're the one getting juggled by this, now you got to make the right decision. Mm -hmm. it's, 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 it, it, at that moment, it's just like, with Mega, the way Mega Man is, it's always this turn while, while he's in the air. <laughs> Oof. Over, oh. over the jump. Now he's got a wall. <laughs> For now, but now it's gone. No, no. Yeah, the, the back air. Mega Man has a lot of tools, it looks like, to threaten Luma. He's just got to play it a little more cautious here. Ooh, not cautious enough. He's going to go down tilt. Looks like Jet's slowly he's piling on more and more, just getting inside Freckles' head, and he just keeps slaying this Luma immediately. That. That tornado again, so terrifying. That really does. Well, that, there ooh, we go. Yeah, nothing else he could really think about. Yeah. Trying to find, figure out ways to get back on stage, but the, the way he was covering that stage, just 
Yeah. Excellent. That's a that's that's their PR right there. We we I mean we mentioned like in the beginning of the game they were having trouble really 